Hi everybody, my name's Scott. I'm the lead artist here at City State. Behind me are the most talented bunch of guys and girls that I've ever worked with. Today we're challenged to create a new vision for Camelot Unchained. Um, Mark always tells us to design outside the box, and uh, that's what we've got to do today. Um, we're taking widely known lore and iconic figures, and we've got to make it our own. So much like we've done with our studio's first ship title, March on Oz, we took Baum's classic Oz cannon and made it our own. So today we're going to present some of our early concepts on the Tawatha de Danon, our TDDs for short, that's our acronym. If, we, if I'm not pronouncing it right, we're calling it TDDs. So, without further ado... So I think it's safe to say these interpretations are pretty unique. These concepts reflect aggression and conflict that exist in our world, where tri-realm combat is always consistent. You'll notice the horns protruding from their heads. This signifies that there are primal beings evolving from the convergence of magic and dreams. The horns also represent power and majesty, serving as a warning to their enemies. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. Um, look forward to new models and concepts coming down the road shortly, and uh, we'll talk to you then. Take care.